Peter Sir Harvey Smith, Hereford's captain. Uh, disappointing result and I suppose a disappointing way in which you failed to defeat today. Yeah, really disappointing. Um, I don't think the performance or the results anywhere near where we want to be or where we should be. And it's, obviously it's not good enough. Um, we all know that, uh, we, but we need to pick ourselves up, dust ourselves down, go. Got a chance to put it right Tuesday night. Another six pointer, another important game. How difficult was it for you for that own goal? Because you, you, I think, were, you, were you trying to clear it at that point? Well, I wasn't trying to hit it into the own net, obviously. No, 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 but from a difficult position. Yeah, yeah. Well, I think, in fairness, I've probably got my body position wrong. When the ball's come in, and I've, I've tried to tried to clear it, but, yeah, obviously it's gone the wrong way. Because at the start of the game, uh, I thought the performance was very bright and very positive. Uh, what did you think about that? Yeah, we, we, start, we started well. We, we, we came up the blocks well. First 10, 15, I feel, thought we were the better side. We were getting corners. We, we were looking, looking threatening. And then the, the fir- their first goal was probably against the run of play. Um, and then, but that's where we need, that's where we need, we need the bigger players on the pitch to stand up and shut up shop and see that period out because then the next 10 minutes that followed were woeful. Was it a question of the first goal being key? Uh, yeah, it was key, but still I think we need to be big enough and bold enough to not let it have that much of an impact on us and, and uh, yeah, just... Um, not not let what happened happen, I suppose. Mm. Concede three. Because changes were made at half time to try and, f- and freshen it up. But did you feel it was a bit better into the second half? <clears throat> yeah, well, we, we changed the shape. We went to a back four in the second half, and I uh, think, yeah, it was probably marginally better. Still not good enough. I still don't think we kept possession well enough in their half and, and, and threatened them enough as where we should be. Um, but. Yeah, there, there was a slight reaction from half time. I think it's just um, yeah, we we need to we need to be better on Tuesday. What what did you feel their main threats were today? Uh, honestly, I think their their biggest threats was our mis- uh, was our mistakes pretty much. Like we 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 put ourselves under pressure. We um, they they weren't they weren't that good a side. They weren't they didn't cause us too many problems when we were on it. It's just we. We we let them we made them look a better side than what they are I think because you got a chance to rectify matters very very quickly at another home game so um, you know the ball really much is back in the place you know laps now to try and seize the opportunity yeah definitely I think it's it makes it an even bigger game on Tuesday now um, must win um, absolute we need to get three points just to get us get our season get our season rolling again but get back to where we we need to be. Thanks very much. Thank you. Oh, how's the atmosphere in the camp? Because obviously we've had a couple of games now, a couple of draws and defeats. And yeah, well, we we've had a before today. We've had a we've had a difficult run of fixtures, and obviously three tough away games on the bounce. And then Ultra Gun as well was they're, they're a tough they're a good side, tough team to play. And we we feel yeah. we've we've dealt with a lot of what what's been what's been put in front of us well up until today obviously t- t- today's a um, you put that to one side I think but um, the, so before today we, we were in a good place I think we were, we were feeling positive and uh, uh, f- feeling like we can we, we can compete with anyone in this league um, obviously uh, after that today the, the loss the, the atmosphere everyone's obviously a bit everyone's obviously down in the change room everyone's f- fuming with what happened but um, like I said, we need to stay together. We need to uh, rally up and, and go again Tuesday and put it right. And how much of a difference does it make partnering Ryan at the back with Jordan out today? Yeah, well, um, obviously Jordan's suspended today with, uh, with with his five yellows and, and Ryan's come in and he's he's solid as well. Like I, I enjoy playing with Ryan just as much as Jordan. Um, I think he, he obviously is that brings that experience he's, he's the older head and, and he's, he seems to he's always in the right position he, he's, he stays composed in, in difficult situations and I think that's down to his experience okay. Thank you Thank you